I got a really bad vibe, like something's gonna go wrong tonight, something bad's gonna happen. This trending video captures the moment police say Daniel Ramirez hit three pedestrians on Abbott Drive Friday night. But what it doesn't capture is what happened before. This guy shows up and it's like there's, there's something wrong with him. Witnesses say Ramirez was noticeably drunk from the start. Over revving, burning out his car. You can smell the alcohol when you walk by him. He is drinking. According to members of the race community, Ramirez was revving his car and showing off his engine. Everybody knew it. Everybody, I knew it. Everybody in the group that I was with knew it. We didn't want to go race him at all. They say he was speeding back and forth down Abbott Drive multiple times until the worst happened. <laughs> I turned, the car was right there and hit me. Those who were there that night don't want Ramirez's actions speaking for the rest of them. But when you combine that huge safety risk that you're already putting yourself in with alcohol or drugs, you're making it 10 times worse. For Brooke Christensen, whose son was one of the three hit that night, she knows the combination of all illegal activities from the racers to the drunk driver resulted in a near tragedy for her family. They shouldn't have been there. And had those cars not been there, he probably would have never slammed on his brakes. Daniel Ramirez was cited for a DUI, no insurance and reckless driving. The witness I talked to said what happened Friday night was enough to scare them away from the race scene for the time being. <laughs>